you know what? I have some game show on TV and I should be relaxing. I'm having an otherwise pretty good day, but I got to vent about something, folks. I got to vent about something. No, not the price of gas. No, not the price of your ass. No, not the price of eggs. No, not the price of your face. I have something that's pissing me off a little bit. And let me tell you, friends, what the fuck is pissing me the fuck off so much that I cussed. Miguel, a fucking gorilla. He's a gorilla from an old Hanna-Barbera cartoon. Miguel, a gorilla for sale. That's the first problem. They want to sell a fucking gorilla, an anthropomorphic gorilla. Let me, let me, let me add. <coughs> it makes me go bananas. It makes me go ape shit just thinking about this. They're trying to sell off this anthropomorphic monkey who's so much like a regular person, except that he's endearing, he's funny, he's charming, he's delightfully clumsy. He goes roller skating in the pet store, and they're freaking selling this guy. They're selling a fucking monkey. It's wrong. A, a monkey man guy. Genuine um, uh, McGill Gorilla for sale. Mr. fucking Peebles, it looks like a little short German man who is up to no good, you know, with his with 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 his little mustache that doesn't even extend out to the ends because he's too much of a pussy to shave properly. He's out there like a short, angry little German man, you know, and he's trying to sell his fucking McGill Gorilla. Yet as the show goes on, he becomes attached to the grill. He still wants to fucking sell him. Who the fuck wants to sell someone they're in love with? Who the fuck wants to do that? That's not even a fetish. And if it was, it's for a fucking monkey between a man and a monkey. I mean, sure, he's a monkey man, but between a man and a monkey, you know, where are those kids going to look at? Oh, they're both male, whatever. The fuck? I should watch the things I say. I'm not going to, though. I just think that McGill Gorilla is a nice, fun, friendly, good guy pleasant ape, friendly to talk to, you know, and, and, and I just feel like he's been given the short end of the stick by this fucking asshole who runs a pet store. You know what they should do? They should burn down the pet store, but not for the insurance money. Get all the fucking animals out. Mr. Peepholes, or that's what I'm going to call him. You know, and yeah, they, they, I mean, I'm not saying they should kill the guy, but I am saying they should ruin his life. You know, and, and they could take the animals to like a really sweet animal sanctuary where, you know, they don't have to go out in the wild and McGill Gorilla doesn't have to eat the other Hanna-Barbera cartoons, George Jetson. He doesn't have to go out and resort to his primal instincts. He could just go be the fun and friendly guy. And with his uh, Yiddish accent or whatnot, he maybe could move to Brooklyn or something. I just think that McGill Gorilla is, is a charming, charming young ape who deserves a little bit better than that. He deserves more than the grape ape. Who gives a fuck? They got a fucking dog named Chugga Chugga that goes Chugga 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 Chugga. Who the fuck's going to buy that dog? Dude, there's something wrong with your dog. There's something wrong with your dog. Anyway, anyway, we need to do something for McGill Gorilla. I think we should give him a free six-month master's degree term at Western Governors University, which even a monkey like McGill Gorilla could get that degree, no problem. I, I miss Mr. Peebles. They should just turn Mr. Peebles' pet store. You know, don't burn it down. Don't burn it down. Turn it into a WGU, Western Governors University, satellite campus where people can come in and use the computer labs and monkeys, and we'll see if they could actually type up, you know, Shakespeare, you know, take type up the manuscript to handle it after all. And McGill Gorilla, he's he has a humanish mind, so of course he could. Chug a chug, he just keep typing chug a chug a chug, and he's a fucking dog. He probably go stick his nose in rabbit feces and like it. Not McGill Gorilla, he eats fucking bananas like a boss.